Hey guys, Miss Renee here. I just wanted to hop on here and say hello and tell you that I miss you. Hope you and your family are doing okay and staying safe and healthy. Uh, I just want to uh, share a few things that I miss from you guys. You see, I feel like I'm one of the most blessed employees at Cosby Elementary because I get to see all kindergarten through eighth grade students. Uh, my kindergarten and my first grade babies, I miss hearing you yell, Miss Renee, Miss Renee, Miss Renee, Miss Renee. I don't know what this computer's doing. It just shut off all by itself. I promise I didn't touch it. And <laughs> my second grade bunch, you are my most competitive ones. Miss Renee, I got a ribbon. Miss Renee, I got two ribbons. Miss Renee, I got five ribbons. Miss Renee, I got more ribbons than she does. <laughs> My third grade bunch, I miss hearing you guys say, Miss Renee, I need your help. I, I really need your help. I can't get this wrong. I need your help. And what do I say? Oh, God's children needs help, right? <laughs> My fourth grade bunch, don't you miss us praying over that printer? <laughs> praying that it prints your test off from Spelling City. My fifth grade bunch, I miss hearing you guys say, Mr. Renee, I'm done. I'm done with everything. I'm done with Study Island. I'm done with Laser Point. I'm done with this. I'm done with that. And what do I say? Guys, I know you're not done with all that Study Island stuff. Get busy. <laughs> and my sixth grade bunch, you're the most talkative. I miss hearing your voices. Um, and what's my response to you? Guys, you've got to be quiet for five minutes and get something done. My seventh grade bunch, you're my most comical. Everything's a joke. Everything's silly. Everything's funny. I miss hearing all your laughs and our conversations. It can't all be business, can it? And my eighth grade bunch, don't you miss our come to Jesus meetings that we have to have every now and again? I love you guys. I love my eighth graders. You guys are awesome. Again, I just want to tell you guys that I miss you, and I hope to see you soon. Bye. Hello, it's Miss Valentine. I just wanted to tell all of you that I miss you. I hope you are enjoying your time off while learning at the same time. I love you. Stay safe. See you soon. There, I'm missing all my kids, kindergarten through 12th at Cosby. I want you all to stay safe, and I love you. I miss and love everyone. I can't wait to see you again. Hey guys, this is Miss Kim. This is my friend Henry. We just wanted to say hi and let you guys know that we're thinking about you and we're praying for you and your families and hope that you all are staying safe and healthy. I miss you guys. I miss you coming to the library. I miss hearing all your stories on how your days are going. I miss all the hugs. Um, I can't wait to see you again. You guys stay safe, and I love you all. We miss you. Hey, I miss you all so much, and this has been one of the hardest things that I think I've ever gone through, but it made me realize how important that our connections are. You know, even at school, just, just our friendships have a lot of meaning and how important our relationships are, and sometimes when we're by ourselves, it's hard. So it's important for all of us to be kind to one another, and I was thinking about creating meaning out of a situation that's hard, and I thought about maybe we could do a, um, like a, some kind of personal time capsule and maybe put all our thoughts in there, um, just so that we all, at, at one point in time, are going to remember this time. And I want to you to remember what kind of, how, could, how did you create meaning out of this? I know my way of creating meaning was that it made me appreciate things that I never realized I appreciated, like just, you know, going out to anywhere to eat and going. Is it dark? It's not dark, is it? No, it's good. Cool. All right. Ready? Yeah. Hey, guys, it's Miss Dogs. I miss you so much, and I can't wait to see you guys. And whenever you get back, I would love to see whatever stuff that you guys made. So artistic stuff, sculptures and scraps, whatever you did while you were on your break. But I love you, miss you, and I will see you soon. Bye. Hey, Cosby Elementary students. Just wanted to say that we are so very proud of you for all the hard work that you put in for this school year. We miss you dearly. Um, we love you. 
I want to tell my little kindergarten class that I, I miss you coming in in the mornings. I miss your hugs. I miss your stories. I just miss our time together. And I just want you to know how much you all mean to each one of us teachers. I miss seeing everybody at school. Uh, miss Reese's kindergarten class, I just want to say that I miss you terribly. I love you all, and I hope everybody stays safe. And hey, Cosby, just wanted to come and say hello. It's a strange time right now, not getting to see everyone and not getting to go into the classroom. Just wanted to tell uh, my friends hi and my kids hello, and I miss you so much. I hope you take this time to get out and play, ride your bikes, spend some good family time together, and read some good books. We hope to see you soon and stay safe. Love you. Hey, guys. Just want to say that I miss you very much. And so does Mochi. And I can't wait to see you guys again. Bye-bye. Hello from Miss Valentine. Hope that everybody's doing well. I hope that you are happy and healthy. And I miss you. And I hope that I'll be able to see you soon. Take care of yourself. Uh, do what you can to stay healthy. Don't forget about that upside-down triangle that we've talked about all year. Don't forget about uh, washing your hands both sides, in between, tips. Thumbs, wrists, uh, don't forget about the oops minion. That will help you now and later. <laughs> I hope to see you soon. Hi, guys. It's Miss Moore. I just want to give a shout out to my littles and let them know that I'm missing them. And I wish we could spend more time together, but I enjoy seeing them when we do our little mini Zoom lessons through the week. So take care of yourselves. You keep sending me your great fun videos and pictures, and we'll see each other soon. Love you. Hey, boys and girls. It's Miss Runyons. I miss you so much. I wish that we could be at school right now working on reading and math, but I know that you guys are working hard at home, and so I just want to tell you to keep that up. I love you. I miss you, and I hope to see you soon. Bye. Hey guys, it's Miss Lisa. I just wanted to jump on here and let you know that I miss you. I miss you terribly. I miss our morning hugs and our handshakes and our stories about how your evening was uh, the day before. I uh, pray that all your families are well and no one's sick. Uh, this is a crazy time. This pandemic that we're going through right now is not anything that Miss Lisa's ever been through. Uh, and I hope I don't ever go through it again. Um... At the end of the day, every day, I pray that God watch over you and keep you safe. Um, I miss you. I hope to see you real soon. We'll be handing out food next week, Monday and Wednesday, from 1 to 10. Don't be afraid to eat it. Miss Lisa has not cooked a thing. Um, sorry there's not any brownies in there. Uh, maybe when we get back to school, that'll be the first thing we'll do. We'll have a brownie party just because we deserve one, right? Um, please take care of yourself. Know that Miss Lisa, at the end of the day, loves you with all my heart. And I cannot wait to see your little faces again. Um, if your families need anything at all, I don't care what it is, you have them to get in touch with me. Um, and I will do whatever I can to help them. I love you great big, and I will see you real soon. Hey guys, this is Miss Ivy. I just wanted to tell you that I miss you. And I hope that you are staying safe and healthy and enjoying this time off, even though it's crazy. I can't wait to see you once this is over. We love you. Hello, Cosby Elementary. I'm sure missing you guys. Missing my fourth graders terribly. Missing the classroom. Missing our routines, our hugs, our talks, our laughs. Um, just our time together. Um, never expected our month of April, the spring and spring, to be this way, but we have to make the best of it. I hope that's what you're doing. Um, maybe learn something that you at home that you didn't know how to do. Maybe learn to cook or help in the garden or um, maybe clean house. You know, all those things can be something we can learn that's not actually in a textbook. So please take care. Know I miss and love you. I can't wait to see your faces, and hopefully that will be soon. Um, just know I love you. Um, stay safe. Bye. 
Hey guys, I miss you. I'm homeschooling my only student. She doesn't listen very well. She's gotten a lot of circles, mostly for eating her own homework. So I miss you a lot. I'd rather be at school with you than my student here. Oh, I love you too. Hi, Cosby Elementary. It's Mrs. Hansen. I want you to know how much I miss you and love you and hate that we are missing out on this time together. I, I hope that you're taking advantage of having this time to do things that you enjoy. I hope you're getting outside when the weather is right. I can't wait to get together and hear about all of your thoughts and feelings on this. And we will be adding this to our timeline at school on the wall. It's a pretty major event that you are experiencing. And I really want you to be taking care of yourself and taking care of your family. And I can't wait to see you again. We all love you and we all miss you. Hi hey guys, this is Miss Carlson. I'm glad, glad we're doing this. I'm glad to say, hey, we all miss you guys so much. I want to say thank you to parents for helping your students out so much. I um, I'm love getting all the questions from parents, too. Thank you for keeping them focused and, and uh, helping them get structure at home so they can keep learning. I, thanks for joining the Zoom class, sixth graders. I've got about 12 or 13 of you on there now, and I love seeing your faces and discussing math. Way to go on keeping up with those assignments. Way to go on keeping up with Study Island. And just keep in contact through Remind with me. I love hearing from everybody. We miss you guys, and we hope to see you soon. Hey, guys. This feels like day 500 of social distancing. But I just want to let you know that I love you, and I miss you, and I pray every day for the health and well-being of your family and i look forward to when i get to see you again love you bye hey hey cosby hey cosby i miss you all i hope that everyone is doing well and staying healthy i miss teaching and being at school with you so much to my 7th graders, you made my first year of teaching 7th grade so amazing, and I wish that we could be in the classroom together. I miss everybody. Stay safe. Stay healthy. I can't wait to see you again. I love you. Bye. Hey, guys. It's Miss Galford. Um, I'm coming to you outside of Walmart. I'm not driving while I'm videoing. I'm just sitting in the parking lot. Um, hope you guys are staying safe and healthy. I miss you all so much. I hope you guys are taking advantage of the meals at school. That helps us keep our free lunch for next year. So please don't feel bad, parents, about uh, going and getting those. Um, like I said, that helps us keep our free lunch for next year, too. Um, I hope you guys are staying busy. I want you to do me one favor and uh, look around you. Think about something that you did today that involved math. You're going to do it every day. You just don't realize it. Anyway, I love you all. I miss you. And I'm going to need lots of hugs whenever we go back. So uh, be, on the, be ready because I'm going to be hugging lots of people. I love you all so much. I love you. God loves you. I can't wait to see you guys. Hello. Is there anybody out there? Yeah. That's what I'm starting to feel like. Being in the house all the time. I only see my family. I wonder if there's anybody else out there anymore. Let me know. I miss you guys. I can't wait to see you again. But as you're here doing... Whatever you're doing during the day, I bet you've said or heard the words, I'm bored, this stinks, I'm tired of this. At least I know I have from my kids. So, uh, think about what can you do to make yourself come out a better person during this time? Can you be a better student, better friend, 
What can you write or create during this time? Some of the best inventors and writers did their best work during exile or quarantine. So when we all get done and we come back together, I can't wait to hear your stories of how you have thought of ways that can make you a better person. Can't wait to see you again. See you later. Bye. Hello, Cosby Elementary. This is Miss Holt. I miss you all. I hope y'all are staying safe and staying healthy. Thank you all for your continued efforts toward your academics. Thank you, parents, for your continued help. Remember, if you need anything, reach out to us through Remind or email. Love y'all. Bye. Greetings, everyone. This is Ms. Myers. I want you to know how much I miss you guys, and I hope you're staying safe out there. Please, please come get your meals so we can keep our numbers up for next year. One thing I want you to do while you're off, read every day. Read every day, Hank, even if it's a book on how to be a better gamer. I need you guys to read something every day. And something else I would like you to take advantage of, Miss Christie's uh, recommendation to do a journal. Actually, I wish I had done a journal, but I think I'll start now. What did you do during this day? What was on the news? How did you feel? Were you bored? Talk about it. This is an excellent way for you guys to learn how to um, express yourself. So do that. Keep that journal, but read. Read something every day, even if it's the funny papers. Also, there are a couple of things that I did not get to because of all the time I was out with Bill. Who's home, by the way? Billy's home. Billy's home. Thank you so much for all you guys who helped me pray for him. Um, there are about three punctuation things that I did not get to that I kept telling you, well, we'll get to this later. So look for me, my smiling face, again, on Remind to help you guys, just to show those to you, because they're real simple, and I know that you'll get them. Anyway, I really miss you guys, and I really love you guys. And I want you to know these two years that I have had you have been two of the absolute best years ever. I have really, really, really enjoyed all of you. And I can't, from the bottom of my heart, I love you guys. Uh, I hope your futures are bright, bright, bright. Hello, everybody. And a special hello to all of my eighth graders. I hope you're staying safe. Hope you're healthy. And I want you to know that you're missed. I miss being in school with you. And uh, hopefully we'll get to see each other soon. But in the meantime, stay safe. Bye. Love you. What's up, Cosby Eagles? So I just wanted to hop in here real quick because this break is getting to be kind of long and uh, we probably not even going to see you for a while so i just wanted to let you know i miss you and while you guys are off why don't you make this a productive time don't just waste it you guys all know i don't like to waste time so how about you find a new hobby you can learn to create woven papers. You guys already know how to do this, but some of you might need a little refreshment. But it's a fun little activity that your parents can even display on a refrigerator or put up on the wall, right? Or have another piece of artwork. Look at that. It's so gorgeous. You can even give it to your teacher like these girls did that. And I so appreciate that. So find a hobby. It doesn't even have to be an artwork. You know, you can exercise. You can create some three-dimensional shapes for mathematics maybe. You can play some fun stuff. Or you know what? What I just did, I looked up how they make Hershey chocolate. I, um, I looked at this awesome design, right? You guys all like your chocolate. I know you do all like chocolate. But look at it. So I was admiring it the other day, how perfect that Hershey name um carved into that and I really wanted to know how they made it so I looked up on YouTube how they make chocolate so that's a little um, fun thing to do for you guys have you ever wondered how they made it or you can 
learn your landmarks and get proficient in money. Another idea is to learn a new language. So many things you guys can do in this long break. So don't waste it. Do something productive. All right, guys. See you soon. Bye. Hey, guys. I hope y'all are doing well. I really miss y'all. I miss seeing you at breakfast and seeing you in the hall. I miss talking to you. Um... I hope your families are well. I hope y'all are well. And um, I encourage y'all to keep a journal or something that y'all can write on day by day and keep up with the things that are going on now. Because this is different. This is something that has never happened before. And y'all say I'm old all the time. So, um, I know, eighth graders, I know you're missing out on a lot. I know that you've missed your prom, and I know that you'll miss your graduation. I have a high school senior who will not get to walk at graduation. She has an autoimmune, and even if they were to have it, she couldn't walk because she couldn't be in the place with all these people. So I understand you're feeling sad and you're feeling like you miss all, you're missing out, but just remember everything they're doing is for your health and safety. Um, I'm also supposed to graduate in November, and so things are kind of crazy there. Um, so we'll just have to see what the world is and just take it day by day and know that I love you and I miss you and I hope to see you all real soon. Y'all have made working in elementary an amazing experience. Seeing you guys every day and seeing you learn and grow and take hold of things has been an amazing experience for me. And I hope to be able to see more of that in the future. So know that I love you and I'm praying for y'all and I really hope to see y'all again soon. Bye. Miss T loves you. Hey guys. Guess who? No, it's not Mickey. It's still not Mickey. Wonder who? Hey, it's me. Just wanted to say hey. And I miss you guys. Hope you all are doing well. Hope you all are staying safe. Wanted to say I missed you all. And hope to see you all soon. Y'all take care of yourself. Bye from me and Mickey. Have a good one. See you soon. Hey, everyone. I just wanted to say hi, and I miss you the whole bench. I hope you're enjoying your time off, and I hope you're getting to go outside and play, and I hope you're doing your homework. You just be very careful and stay safe. I miss you and I love you. Bye. Hey, guys and gals. I want to say that I miss you. I hope everyone is staying safe, enjoying staying at home, and going outside and doing fun stuff. I can't wait to see you again. Bye. Hey, guys. It's Miss Mandy. I miss you all. I can't wait till we're all back together. This is just one crazy time and not something all of us are really enjoying being stuck at home, being stuck without doing things we want to do. Um, can't wait till we're all back together in the classrooms, in the building, having fun together, saying hi and good morning, good afternoon. I hope you're all staying safe and healthy and enjoying your time with your family. Um, hopefully I'll see you soon. Bye. Hey, Cosby Elementary. Uh, just wanted to reach out and say that I miss you guys a whole lot. Um, hopefully you're still learning some things. Um, hopefully you're staying safe. You know, take precaution. Uh, take care of yourselves. Uh, continue to learn each day. Do something fun outside. You know, got to have a good time too. Anyway, miss you guys. Take care. Hi, everybody. I hope you're safe. 
Get out and enjoy the sunshine. Get out and enjoy the sunshine. <laughs> Hope to see you soon. Bye. Bye. Hey, Cosby Elementary. Just want to tell my students that I miss them. I miss seeing all the other kids in the building. I hope you all stay safe. Have a good time while we're out of school. And learn as much as you can. Hope to see you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, friends and family. Uh, I want you all to meet my little buddy, Chico. He may be a little hard to see because of the color. Um, but I hope you've been staying safe. I hope you're enjoying some of your time away, but I hope you remember that we're here for you and, you know, you can reach out to any of us and we'll, we'll help you however we can. Um, I've enjoyed meeting all of you all in my first year at Cosby Elementary School, and I cannot wait to see you all again. I promise we will have some great things ahead when we can all be together again. Um, like my good friend Luke Combs said, uh, there will be light after dark when we can be closer than six feet apart. See you all soon. Hey guys, I know there looks like a shadow is on my face, but I hope you can see me. I want you to know how much I miss you, and I hope you're staying safe and healthy, making sure that your family's safe and healthy. Hmm, it feels weird. It feels weird not to be here. I just want to see your faces and be able to interact with you, and this is so weird. I would like to encourage you to do one thing specifically during this time that we're away from school. Fill out a journal and record the things that are happening around you and in your family and how you feel about the news and what you're learning about the COVID-19 pandemic. I think you'll be interested to read that later in life and you'll have a, a your own personal recording with your writings about what it felt like to live through this. This is weird. I'm, you know, I always say I'm old as dirt. Well, I am, and this has never happened, and it's weird. It's weird to think about wearing a mask everywhere and not being able to see people or go places. I never would have dreamed that this would happen during my lifetime. I'm sure you hadn't thought about it either. Oh, well, I hope you're coming to get our meals. They're very yum. I've been cooking. Isn't that scary? Mondays and Wednesdays working in the kitchen. I don't get to see a lot of you, but I hope uh, you're coming by to get meals. Even if your family doesn't think you need them, we need you to come get meals. And yeah, we've been serving up all kinds of good things. Pizza, some of your favorites, chicken nuggets, PB&J sandwiches, all kinds of Pillsbury breakfast items. So don't be missing out on that. And I truly hope that I get to see you soon and can get caught up with everybody. Um, take care. Be safe. I love you. Mm, I guess that's it. Hope to see you soon. Bye.